From 1992 to 2000, Mikhail Popkov is suspected of murdering up to 29 women. He would pick up slightly intoxicated women who were just leaving bars or parties, using his police car and uniform to gain the victim's trust in some of the murders. Popkov would then drive them to the forest, where he raped and murdered them. Mikhail Popkov was born on March 7, 1964, in Russia. He worked as a policeman before later becoming a security guard. He and his wife, Anne, had a daughter. His wife was also in the police and provided an alibi for Popkov several times. It has been speculated that Mikhail Popkov had been targeting women who resembled his reportedly alcoholic mother who abused him in his childhood. His victims were reportedly axed, stabbed, or strangled to death. One of the victims was decapitated and another's heart had been ripped out. He would rape victims after they were deceased as well. One of Popkov's victims survived his attack and later identified a photo of him. However, police chose to believe Popkov's wife, who had provided an alibi. Mikhail claimed he stopped killing when he became impudent and attracted syphilis. He'd been labeled the Wednesday murderer by police, referring to the day when many of the bodies were found. The werewolf was arrested on June 23, 2012, when he went to Vladivostok to buy a car after leaving his DNA sample along with 3,500 other police officers. He was suspected of killing at least 29 women, 25 of whom were aged 19 to 28, and four were who were aged 35 to 40. All of the victims were residents of Angarst, Irkutsk region. 
He confessed to 24 murders and was later charged with them on October 31, 2013. Popkoff was convicted of 22 murders in 2015 and confessed to 59 additional homicide three years later. On December 10, 2018, he was convicted for 56 of the 59 additional homicides. For three killings, the police could not find sufficient evidence. Popkov received a second life sentence, and there were calls for him to be executed, but this was unavailable as capital punishment in Russia at that time.